<laughs> the supervisor of the plant, Miss Danza, is threatening me. Yes, please. <laughs> I'm sorry. <laughs> How can I have a Really? A bitch, man. Craig, really? Man, I'm fuck you, man. You cross the line. You cross the line. Cross the line. Cross the line. Sai daqui, porra! Para de me. Who you don't know. Hi there. Yeah. How are you doing today? You, you might want to have a little sense of Hi. What's being appropriate? Being I'm not I'm just hanging out. I'm a little baby. Feed me. Honey. Feed me milk. Hi there. You want your mommy? You want your mommy? I need some milkies, mommy. I'm a little boy. I need my milkies. Feed me milk. You guys are obviously straight white men, right? Never had any Feed me milk, mommy. Being comfortable. Mommy, I've never experienced any diversity. I'm a little baby. My life's a piece of cake. I'm an actor. Obviously, a straight white woman. Thank you. Head on out. Like that. Don't touch him. No, no, no. You, you, go, go you bend over for me. Could you bend over? Hey, get the fuck oh, out of here. Get out of here. What are you doing? You bend over for me. Hey, can someone help, please? Calm down, pal. Calm down. Calm down. Calm down, buddy. You're horrible people. I'm a baby and you're grabbing me. And you're harassing people. That guy grabbed a little baby. What's your problem? Where'd Jan go? That was insane. Oh, that, that was good though. That was insane. You, can you bend over? Mm -hmm. I choked that guy out, man. Did you see that? No, but that was... Did you see that? I was not nervous at all. They're so pathetic. These two girls grabbed my butt in the gym, then laughed at me when I got upset. They tried to act like I was tripping when I wasn't okay with it. I have to show y'all why we need to move out of America. Look at this. They're selling lion chops. They're taking exotic animals and cutting them up and putting them in our local grocery stores. Look, I'm in Safeway. They're putting lion meat in the fucking grocery store. Snoop just did a video and killed his whole motherfucking thing. Shit, if I do it. Shit, if I do it. Mm. A lot of them do it, man. I ain't gonna let them niggas show me up, man. Damn, yeah. you done drunk half of it already. Nah, you ain't. I don't need no narrators. It's just me. They only supposed to hear you. I ain't gonna let him show me up. Cut, man. Cut, man.
Hey, for real. Uraraka, are you sure this is what I should wear on my date with Midoriya? I mean, don't get me wrong, I appreciate you letting me borrow all of this, but uh, I'm not very comfortable. Keep talking. And where the tree at to hang people at? Where is that? Where is the hanging tree at? In your backyard. Gentlemen, can I please? No, no, no. He just I said there's a hanging tree down there to hang people like me. That's racist. That is. That is racist. racist. Y'all go take his back and he's being racist? Crying motherfucker. She's a crying motherfucker. You know what? That is he's fucking human. horrible of you. He's just as human as you. Are you are you along with them? Yes, he is. Okay, but why is he being fucking racist to me talking about there's a fucking hanging tree down there? Are you are you along with that? Are you down with that as well, like him? So, uh, he's my dad. First off, that yeah, don't get off don't fucking property. touch me. Don't touch me. I'm not on your property. Don't touch me. Don't fucking touch me. Don't fucking touch me. Do y'all see this shit? I'm not saying nothing. I'm telling you to get off my property. Fuck you. Now what? Let's do it. Come on, let's go. Slap me. Hit me. I want you to. I want you to I hit me. I love you. You're my brother. No, I'm not your brother. You're Don't touch brother. me. This is fucking You're racist brother. to the most. You're my brother. You're wrong. You're my brother. You're wrong. You get out You're of my, my face. I don't understand what You're that my means. Brother. You know where you are? Do you know the history of the town? I don't give a fuck. I'm not doing anything to anybody. Y'all gonna kill me? Kill me. Kill me. Do it. You're my brother. Do y'all see? Don't touch me. I love you, baby. Are y'all gonna allow this shit to happen? This racist stuff? No, don't touch me. Don't touch me. Baby, why are don't you so me. upset? Don't touch why me. So why are you touching me, man? That... Okay, come on. This is crazy. Calm down. Calm down. You're causing a big old fuss. Because you. I didn't do anything to I, anyone. I, honey, I know, honey. Jesus loves you. It's okay. Do y'all see this at Jesus, the most? Jesus loves you. You just don't get it right now. Calm down. Can you let me go fucking leave, please, ma'am? But don't you don't, but you're steady touching me. Honey, I love you, baby. You're steady touching me, ma'am. This is a assault. Mama? Do you have a mama? This is an assault. Do you have a mama? This is Do you have a mama? Ma'am, can you, you leave have me? A you, what are you doing? I'm here? doing a job. Well, and I'm not bothering anyone. Well, you are now. You got everybody all upset. But you're baby. touching me. Don't touch come me, ma'am. You're touching me. I have to call the police. That's assault. I'm taking you. He's right here. Let's go. Don't through. touch me. You don't touch I'm me. Not, I'm not, baby. Let's can you leave me alone? Y'all going to allow this shit to Come happen on, like nobody on. cares? Nobody hey. sees this racial shit going on? We, honey, the sheriff's right here. You can tell him all you want. Your dad just said there's a hanging tree for niggers like me. What does that mean? What does that mean? And I did not disrespect your dad. I asked him nicely. Excuse me, sir, are you a registered voter? He said, no. I said, thank you. 
And then he turned around and said, there's a hanging tree down the road for niggers like me. Oh, that's no. exactly what the fuck he what said. The hell? That's and up. all of them, all of them ganged up on me. I have it on video. I'm so sorry that happened to you. And everybody is going along with that shit. Are you okay? <laughs> no. What do you need right now? Look, I can show you the oh, video. Yeah. It's okay. Oh my God, I'm so sorry. And all of them just ganged up on me. It's okay, you're oh alright. You're alright. Hey TikTok, what's up? Um, yep, yeah, I'm the guy in the video yesterday that that happened to out in Virginia City, Nevada. I just want to tell everyone, thank y'all for all of y'all support. Thank y'all for coming in and putting y'all comments and finding this guy and finding these people because this is unacceptable. Like, I just want everybody to see that racism don't just goes on to person to person racism is like in all these little small cities and small towns as y'all can see i did nothing wrong to that guy i was only doing a job and i'm very committed to my job all i did was ask him what he signed my petition to lower the attorney fees that they have in the state of nevada and this guy just started going off and saying all these derogatory rules and nasty things and then his family came outside and then the chatting and all that in the background that was very hurtful um i know i could have went about it a little different way but at that moment i didn't know what else to do i was cornered in by a lot of people i was the only african-american that was there with thousands of other people and nobody came to my help but i do want to give a shout out to this lady named tiana she did come to my help. I want to get out a shout out to everybody on TikTok, Facebook, and Instagram that came to my um, help, that was there for me, sending me love. And I thank you guys for all the different messages. Um, I got to go. I got to get back to work. But I will go live and go into more detail of what happened so you guys can know the more detail um, of everything. So I thank you guys and... Y'all have a wonderful and blessed day. I thought the dog shit at my best friend's tree was bad, but they've came back and made it even worse. I have an extremely sad update about my best friend's tree. If you don't know, over the weekend, somebody came and wrote MAGA all over the tree and left a note with a literal pile of dog shit saying that they don't care that Mallory's dead. After two different times of Mallory's mom coming and washing off the tree and refixing it up, the person has came back and back and back. Finally, Mallory's mom put up cameras in the park and ask that we all just let karma get the best of this man. However, the man has came back. And I thought the shit was bad. Unfortunately, he came back and cut Mallory's tree down. He removed all the rocks and cut my best friend's memorial tree down. This tree gave a lot of hope to a lot of people, including her family and me, her friends, and a lot of other people. Mallory was a shining light to this world. She always has been, she always will be and her light will continue to be passed on, regardless of evil motherfuckers that do shit like this. I have set up a P.O. box. A lot of people have been asking me to send stones to Mallory's mom. I was gonna do it as a surprise um, so she could go put them on the tree, but then I woke up to this this morning. I ended up texting her mom and telling her about the stones because I wanted to keep it a surprise, and this is how she responded. She said, oh my gosh, that is wonderful. I can't thank you enough and you just made my whole days and I'm crying happy tears. I was really sad because every day I paint a few more stones to put there and I have some more waiting here to be painted and I thought I won't do this anymore. You are so very sweet and I can't thank you enough. Can you put something on TikTok about how I thank everybody for their compassion and kindness? I really, really, really hope you guys continue to send and make stones. On Monday, the P.O. Box will be officially ready for um, shipments to be sent in. But I think her mom needs it more than ever now. Sticking my yacht at at and where everybody me. knows I have a pee pee. Excuse me, excuse me. Yeah? You gotta put your stuff on and get out of here right now, please but, and thank you. But why? You have to get out but of here. But I was dancing. I need you to get out of here, please and thank you, before I call the police. Not the police! Hey, Not the police! Oh, <laughs>
Justin Durban hates. Lemony. <sighs> Zest the Sour Boy. Yeah. Sweet rocks. And now incorporate. <laughs> Hello? Woo! Lemony Snicket. Rectangular prisms. Twice. Seems like a lot, but what do I know? <laughs> it's so fluffy! Chimkin balloons, but one at a time. Lorp. <laughs> I should have used a bigger bowl. There we go. We eat that we shall eat. Baking a powder. The tears of racists called out to the media. Whiskey! And the buttery boo! Union eyes! Ooh! <laughs> Time for a hot date. Hasta la pasta. <laughs> Whiskey! Drizzle! Ah! For the glory of the Gerbil Empire! What is one thing that you've never told your ex? That I had a... Um... I told him that I was just like this girl, but um, actually there's a guy there, and like, like we have to together. Yeah, I didn't tell him that, but he just thinks that like he just thinks that like a girl, but not he didn't know that there was a guy there. Yeah, it was kind of mean, right? But it like yeah, my mm -hmm. I like stuff. Oh, okay. Yeah.